Hey guys, Street here. Welcome back to Street Play Secret of Mana. We're going to go ahead and continue from the end of Kippo Village, I believe it's called. I went ahead and played off the air for a little bit and leveled up a couple times. I got maybe one or two levels with each character. So we're going to go ahead and continue our way to Guy's Naval. No, no, no. Haha, -ha, let's get this chest. Oh no, Busby! Kenny won't fit. Boom, got him. Alright. Guys, Naval's up this way. Uh, last time we tried to go to the forest, but we couldn't because she. Uh, well, we needed to go to the Guys, Naval in the first place, but she wouldn't go. So we had to go to the forest first. And then we found out we couldn't get through the forest without an axe, and found out that the dwarves of Guy's Naval make axes. So, what we're gonna do is head to Guy's Naval, get ourselves an axe, and then go back to the forest. There we go. Oh, no. Shoot. <laughs> I figure I might as well attack things on the way. Level up. Oh, see, there's a chest up there too. I wonder what I got. Attack him! Attack him! Jeez! Ah, uh, wow. Well, there she goes. Buzzbee gets whacked. Buzzbee. Buzzbee. Buzzbee, Buzzbee. Buzzbee. Why does that name sound familiar? Buzzbee. Buzzbee! Oh, did you. I think it was a Sega Genesis game. Did you guys ever play <laughs> a game called Busby? It was like Bubsy, Bubsby the Cat. And it, like, it was a really cartoony game. You always had silly ways whenever you died. You collected balls of yarn and stuff. I don't know why I remember that game, but whatever. 22 GP inside. Awesome. You could always use more money. Nope. Die, Buzzbee Cat. I mean, Buzzbee. Ooh. This game I always found a lot of fun because... Whoa. Because, uh, it's... It's an action RPG. It's it's not the same as, like, a, your typical RPG where you run into random encounters. Like, well, let's take Final Fantasy for instance. Punch a lot of crap. There's a trap. Um... In Final Fantasy, you'd walk around, and it'd be just like this. You wouldn't be able to see the enemies on the overworld, or the map, or whatever. And then suddenly, whoosh, you go into the battle screen, and you start selecting attacks and magics and stuff. This game is cool in the fact that it shows all your enemies. And you sit there and attack them. Hence the name Action RPG. Plus, you still level up and everything, too, so... There's those little bats. I think they're called blats in this game. Oh, there's the goblins. Remember those things that kidnapped me earlier in the game? Ow. And by far one of the worst enemies in the game, in my opinion, the slime. Because not only can it dodge your attacks really well, but it constantly splits into pieces and can regenerate like re regenerate itself. On. There we go. That one didn't give me as much trouble as they usually give me, but man, those things are annoying. <sighs> Alright, but let's go ahead and continue this way. Sleeping Goblin. These goblins use their axe as well. He barely knows me. And uh, later you run into Chobbins. Those are uh, in the forest. Actually, I think you guys already saw them. Yeah, my last video. The Chobbins are the ones that shoot the little bows and arrows. They're called Chobbin Hoods. Get it? Chobbin Robin? Ha 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 ha. That's so funny. Maybe I should heal her. 26 HP out of 82. Eh. chest. Let's go ahead and kill this goblin guy, then I'll grab it. Although sometimes I'm afraid to grab these chests, because they have traps in them, usually. 
Ah, oh, 28 GP. Huh. Surprised, because those usually have traps in them. The ones from goblins, like Choblin, Chobbins and stuff. Oh yeah, there's two directions to go. You can't go this way because there's lava, so... We'll have to go up and around. I love how you can push your bodies around when they're down. I think you can do that to bats, too. Yep. Or blats, as they're called in this one. There we go. Whoa! Got him. Alright. Continue up this way. Alright. Kill this goblin? I think there's two more. Yeah, this guy and this guy. Ow! One damage. <laughs> Hit it, that little skull. What was that noise just now? If you look carefully, there's no more lava. Wow, so that means we can go down there now. So, down we go. Whoa. There we go, Kid Goblin gets whacked. There's another one of those mushroom guys. Oh, I missed. Oh, boy. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this chest real quick. Hope it's not a trap. 28 GP. Yay! Okay, let's go. Oh, this is a stairway. This cave's a little longer than I remember. Oh, crap. Yeah, there's this move called Balloon, which stops you in your tracks. It doesn't damage you, but it just keeps you held still for a while and lets them get free hits on you. I hate it. Oh god, okay. No, 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 run, Jasmine. I don't like fighting those things. There's nothing over there anyway. Might as well get some attacks in on this goblin guy. There you go. This goblin guy, too. Ha! Alright, almost. Shoot. I don't think we have to go up that way. I hope we don't. Let me look. Nope. Okay, then we go up this way. Come on, Jasmine, get up here. I just want to skip the slime. The slimes are pointless fighting against them. I mean, I guess you can get ESP, but I really don't care. I don't think it's going to make that much of a difference. So let's go down here. Oh yeah, okay. Notice this? Huh, I can't get up. So, let's try and find another way up there. There's a s another sleeping kid goblin. And look, there's one of those switches from before. Let's see what this one does. Just hit it. And looky there. wonder what that did. Let's go and see. Sudden music change? That means we must be close to the Gnome Village! Yes, that's right, we made it. So here we are in the land of the gnomes. Alright, here's the ends. Yeah, I'll go ahead and go save. One night is 15 GP. Wanna stay? Sure. 15 GP is a good deal. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and call the video here, guys. We made it to Gaia's Navel, in the village of the dwarves. Or no, I kept on saying gnomes earlier, didn't I? Well, it's the village of the dwarves. So, anyway, next time we'll continue on our way to the forest. Thanks, guys. Tune in next time.